Calgary West. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Uh, when he was Minister of Service Alberta, Manmi Bueller oversaw many services, including those uh, offered by more than 200 registry agents. Uh, he always sought to ensure Albertans received efficient services while providing fairness to private sector partners. So to the Minister of Service Alberta, given that many rural-based registries are providing services at a loss to ensure rural residents have convenient access to them, and given that these agents were slated to receive a dollar fee increase on July 1st, how is your government assuring the stability of rural-based registries, and will you be establishing a formula-based model for future increase? Honourable Minister. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and thank you to the member for the question. I know that the member for Calgary Greenway believed that Service Alberta needed to continually move forward in providing quality services to the people of Alberta uh, at the best value. And like him, we certainly value the role that registry agents play in delivering those services on behalf of the government. So we continue to work productively with registry agents to ensure that Albertans do receive the quality services they deserve. And we continue to be committed to ensuring that rural Albertans have access to the quality government services that they need. For supplemental. Thank you, Minister. And thank you, Mr. Speaker. To the same Minister. Uh, given the province uh, plans to offer more services online and has built the My Alberta eServices uh, portal to do so, and given that Alberta has a proven partner which continues to uh, offer convenient services to all citizens, will your government commit to offering registry agents the ability to participate in the Government of Alberta's future plans for expanded online services? Thank you. Honourable Minister. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and thank you once again to the member for the question. I certainly know that the member for Calgary Greenway recognized that our world is changing rapidly, and it's important that our government services keep up with the opportunities and demands that come with that. So we continue to seek opportunities to strengthen our registry services, including expanding our online services so that Albertans who choose to access services that way will have the convenient access that they are looking for. So as we move forward, I can commit to proceeding with the option that will best meet the needs of Albertans, uh, that they have convenient services at the best value. Second supplement. <coughs> thank you, Mr. Speaker, and thank you to the Minister. Uh, same Minister, given that uh, the number of registries has not increased since 1993, and given that uh, in estimates you indicated to Manmeet that uh, you are looking into issuing requests for proposals for new registries. When your ministry issues the new RFPs, will you guarantee the Government of Alberta is provided with the best value possible by ensuring the highest bidder is awarded the contract? Thank you. Prime Minister. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and thanks to the member for the question. The procurement process that the Government of Alberta established uh, is open, transparent and committed to ensuring that Albertans get the best value possible. So in terms of any possible changes to registry services, I certainly can guarantee to follow that process to ensure that we can continue to serve Albertans efficiently and effectively uh, at the value that they expect and deserve. <laughs> 